first alert forecast. You know, Liz, there's something so special special about those small town yeah. festivals. I mean, of course, we have Three Rivers here in Fort Wayne, but I went to Ossian Days last year, and it's really fun. I mean, it's a nice way to extend the summer a little bit. Yeah. They have it later in the year. Um, but this weekend, they had some hot weather for it. Yeah, they did. In fact, September's really a busy time of yeah. year for Northeast Indiana and Northwest Ohio. You have Bluffton Street mm -hmm. Fair, then it moves up to DeKalb County. I was going to say, I knew that's coming up. That's yep. a really big one. It is. So, yeah, a lot of stuff to look forward to, which are typical fall activities. Yeah. But it's still really not feeling like that. I mean, we technically are still in summer, so we've got mm -hmm. a little ways to go. I want to show you the latest. This really screams summer into fall. Another tropical system we're keeping an eye on. Currently a potential tropical cyclone, but expected to upgrade later today to become a tropical storm, which will eventually be called Helene. This is over by the Carolinas right now, having max winds of only about 45 miles per hour. This will not strengthen to become a hurricane, at least it's not projected to. But as it moves on shore over the course of the day today, going into tomorrow, things will slowly start to weaken. You can see that little bit of a curve in the path. In fact, the path that we've seen from this system is shortening a little bit more and getting a little bit tighter. And because of that, where we were previously thinking we might get a stray rain shower or two, it looks like, again, this might be another system where that rainfall is just short of our area when we desperately need it at this point. Certainly, this is something we'll keep an eye on, but the most optimi optimistic places here in 21 country at this point for any rainfall look to be Northwest Ohio. But again, not all of us looking that way. Satellite and radar right now, mainly clear skies. We're holding on to beautiful sunshine again today with barely any passing clouds. In fact, future track shows you a whole lot of nothing throughout the day today. But I will start to advance as we go past today, going into about Wednesday, building in on a little bit of additional cloud cover because of that tropical system. The thing that's still in question right now is if we could get maybe a quick stray shower to Unfortunately, again, if we even get any rainfall at this point on Wednesday with this system, it looks to be very minor, brief, isolated showers. Nothing that's really going to be needed when it comes to the drought that we have. Temps right now, 50s and 60s. We're at 58 degrees here in Fort Wayne. And watch as we warm things up today. It is another hot day, just like what we had this past weekend. In fact, temperatures today, almost a repeat of what we had yesterday. 1 o'clock, we're already in the mid to upper 80s across the region. Hottest places looking to be over in Wabash County and Grant County, where we could get close to hitting 90 degrees. Here in Fort Wayne, I think we're just a step below that upper 80s in the forecast today. When our average high this time of year is 77 degrees. We're about 10 degrees above that for your high temperature today. We'll maintain the mid to upper 80s through the afternoon and the evening. So this is about 3 p.m. at this point. Here's a look at temperatures by the time kids are out of school, looking to be really warm for any after school activities. And again, not until later tonight, we start to really cool things off. In fact, late tonight into early tomorrow morning, 50s and perhaps even a few 40s back on the map. Going into your seven day forecast, here's what you can expect. Another week of the 80s. In fact, this seven day forecast, really not a whole lot of change. You'll see a lot of sunny days, by Wednesday, bringing in a little bit of that additional cloud cover because of that tropical system we're keeping an eye on. Temperatures for the whole week really not straying that far off. And overnight lows in the 50s and 60s. Okay, Liz. Summer lives on to see another day or two or I guess a week. Oh, a week. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks so much.